Okay, so here it is, folks. I decided that I was going to make a beef wellington. First of all, you have to catch your beef. Once you have that, you start off by making a duck cell of mushrooms. Now, what this really means is that you sling it in a blender, get them really nice and small, put them in a frying pan, and let it cook off so that your moisture is all gone. You then put that to one side, let it cool. While that's cooling, grab hold of your beef, your fillet, it looks good, then you put it in a very hot pan so that it starts to brown. Gordon Ramsay says only brown one side. I didn't listen to him, I browned all sides, got it nicely caramelized in a really hot pan. You then put that on one side to cool. In the meantime, while the duck cell and the meat is cooling, put out some cling wrap and I spread bacon on this. The recommendation is to use pancetta or something like that. Don't get pancetta here, or well, not that I could see, so I just used back bacon. I used the back bacon because it's nice and broad and I had a nice piece of fat on it. So I put a few pieces of those down. When that's done, I take the cold or the cooled duck cell and I spread that over the bacon so that it more forms a layer. Once the layer is formed, you take the caramelized fillet and douse it liberally with mustard. Some people like the very hot mustard. We didn't have hot English, so I used Dijon mustard. But I covered the whole thing completely with it. You then put that onto your onto the bacon with the cling film and then wrap it up so that it's totally covered and sling the cling from around so that it forms a nice sausage type shape. Let me just recap here. The brown meat covered in mustard is laid onto the duck cell. It's put on top of the, which is on top of the back and you use the cling film to wrap it up nice and tight. That then goes into the fridge to get nice and cool for about 15 or 20 minutes. While that's cooling, I take out my ready-made pastry, roll it out a couple of times so that it's about the size that I wanted. I take an egg wash, put that on, all ready for the meat. Once I take the meat out the fridge, remove the cling film, that's very important. Put that onto the pastry, wrap it up like a parcel, cut off any loose edges, and make sure that there are no holes. That all then gets washed again with that all gets it gets patterned, egg wash put over it, and you put it into a hot oven, 200 degrees, and it should have already been preheated to 200 degrees for 20 minutes. When the 20 minutes is up, turn it down to 180 for another 10 minutes. Take it out, let it rest for at least 10 minutes. In the meantime, the wife had made roast vegetables, which we had with our beef wellington, and it was delicious, and it was the first time I did it, and I'm going to do it again. <laughs>